Hi, I'm Jared Falt, and today I want to discuss some two-handed hi-hat beats. So if you're just starting out on the drums, you probably noticed drummers primarily play with one hand on the hi-hat, one hand on the snare. But sometimes you'll see drummers go with two hands up on the hi-hat, and then they'll bring their right hand down to hit the snare on the beats two or four, and then occasionally bring their left hand down. Um, a popular song is Sunday Bloody Sunday by U2. That's throughout the whole song, he's pretty much doing two hands on the hi-hat. So, uh, that's where I first got inspired to actually try it. And once you try it, it's addicting. So you're going to love doing it. So what I recommend doing, just to kind of develop it, is start off with an eighth note beat, and then just naturally go from that eighth note beat and then bring up your left hand, hitting it on the E's and the A's, and bring your right hand down to hit the snare on beats two and four. I'm going to show you how that looks. All right, so it's basically just a single stroke roll on the hi-hat. Right, left, right, left. Bring your right hand down to hit the snare. If you're left-handed, you can lead with your left hand and then bring it underneath your right hand, or you can just practice leading with your right. Okay, so that's one way to try and develop them. Now, I've also written out 10 exercises here that are gonna take it from basically just on the hi-hat to on the snare drum and then some added kick stuff and then bringing down the left hand a bunch, okay? And so you're gonna, Take some time and just do it really slow. Like, don't think you have to play this at the exact same tempo that I'm demonstrating that right away. Sometimes just go really, really slow. Like, um, I'm just gonna pick one out here. Let's say number eight. If I were first learning this, I would practice it like this. Okay, so that's so slow it wouldn't even work in a song. But what it's gonna help you develop is the single stroke roll and it's gonna get you comfortable with bringing your left hand and your right hand down. All right, so I'm gonna play through these 10 exercises and show you how they all sound.
All right, so there are 10 variations that you can take to your kit and start practicing. Now, for coming up with your own variations, I'd recommend just forgetting about the bass drum and going on the hi-hat and then just moving your hands down randomly. You know, even if you're having trouble developing these, just forget about those and just practice moving your hand down to the snare randomly. Let me show you how that looks quickly. All right, so after you do that, you can just insert the bass drum wherever you want. You can insert it on the one, two, three, four, or just the one and the three. It's totally up to you. You're the boss. So if you're watching this video on drumlessons.com, just click below. You can download the sheet music, take it to your kit, and study these beats and know you're going to love them. If you're watching it somewhere else, just find the link in the video description, click that link, come back to the website, and uh, you can download the sheet music, take it to your kit. I'll see you again soon.